So it's 18th of October 2016 and this is my first uh, video diary in relation to our British Muslim Values project. I've been hoping to do this for a little while but I haven't got round to it and if I'd have recorded this perhaps a week or two ago it would have been rather different because we've now had I think four perhaps slightly fewer of our filmmakers confirmed and in place out of a total of eight that we're looking for. I guess the idea of this is to keep some kind of a record uh, about the project's development and my feelings toward it and uh, record how it's going in a format that's vaguely similar to what we're asking people to make for us, so to do it by film rather than um, a written diary. I don't know whether it will be of interest to anyone or, or of use for anything, but um, but it's a couple of minutes of my time. Um, so here we go. I guess the first thing I wanted to, to record at this stage was that it's been really, really hard work so far getting our filmmakers in place. We've tried lots, we've contacted local organisations, we've worked quite hard, I think, on social media. We've had our university, UEA, releasing press releases. We've gone through contacts in local communities and we've had much, much less response than we'd expected. And, and this has been a source of concern, at least for me, so far, and I guess it's hard to know why that's been the case. It doesn't match particularly closely onto some previous work that I've done with Michael Lister, where recruiting people to work on a on a project of counterterrorism around counterterrorism powers was much easier. I guess the one possibility is that we're asking quite a lot more from our filmmakers here. That we're asking people to make and edit their own film in relation to British Muslim values, whatever that means. Another issue might be that people are concerned that we have some kind of a hidden agenda or that this is being driven by government interests or security concerns or something like that and we're obviously keen to try to avoid that but um, but that fear might still be there. So things are slightly better than they were I guess worries that I that I currently have and there are <laughs> there are lots um, are we are we going to get the eight filmmakers that we need and are they going to produce the types of film that we want or that we need to, to explore the kinds of questions that, that motivate the project and what do we do if, if either of those is not, not the case. Um, what happens if we recruit people to work on the project and then they disappear or, or they don't deliver uh, in the time frame that, we, that we're working toward or what happens if the equipment that we've sourced for the project and that we're currently in the position of, of buying, what if that doesn't work or isn't appropriate for the kind of thing that we're after? And I guess more broadly, are we going to get it all done in time? The project's already slightly behind where we hoped it would be, which is not unusual. Um, but how are we going to manage to get it completed within the 12 months alongside everything else that we're all working on? I guess it's probably important at this stage to say that I'm still genuinely excited about the research. I really do think it has value for ourselves, for the filmmakers, hopefully in terms of telling their stories but also the skills they'll be developing but also broader public social cultural value too I hope and, and I really do believe that um, I guess the, the the key problem for me at least is that until those films have made or until we started working on the films they're not we're fairly limited I think in terms of what we can do in relation to this project and that doesn't help me I'd, I'd rather be kept busy with with one aspect or another of it so there we go this is my first attempt at a video diary if that's what this is best thought of as um <laughs> hopefully i'll make another one at some point but that's probably enough for now so if you've watched this you have my my sympathies and my um and my thanks cheers